What is going on, everybody, and welcome as Oliver Barton gets ready to make his seventh AAA start of the season. Last couple starts have not been that great. We haven't been able to get out of the fifth inning. Last start, we went four and two-thirds, gave up six hits, three runs, one walk, two strikeouts, and we took the loss. Wasn't that great. So, we're also coming up towards the end of the season. We probably have about two or three more starts left. I'm, I'm not sure how it's going to fall. Anyway, I'll go ahead and bring you back when the game's all loaded up. Maybe not. In a tight divisional race coming down the stretch, a comes the coach to teach his young players about how to finish. We're in season's end, and here we are, right in the thick of it, with a chance to make our fate. How we respond is going to tell us a lot about what we're made of. Let's go to work. Another pep talk, another two times boost. Happy about that one. An and here we go again. Currently in the minors. Trying to get to the game. Okay, this is our agent. Oliver, at some point we're going to be getting a contract extension offer to stay on with the bats. Fact is, minor league money is never going gonna be a lot. Okay, whatever. Should I ask for more? Just happy to be playing the game. I'm gonna say I'm happy to be playing the game. can probably ask for a little more and get it, but let's not push it. Just keep improving. We'll get your payday eventually. Yeah. The money doesn't matter in this, so whatever. Third time. Holy crap. Hey, Manager Harper. We confront a major rival today, Ben, for a few games at a critical time. As well, EA postseason series. How you respond will show us what you are made of. Bring it. Another pep talk. Another two times boost. Just loading up on the boost right now. Bring it back. Welcome. All right, so here we go. We're 61 and 67. The Indianapolis Indians are Indians are 62 and 66. We are one game behind the Indians, so this is. It's got some implications to it. We could take, uh, we could tie in the standings. With one game left in the series after this one. So, no pressure or anything on this game. The mark here, he's hitting 155 on the year. And they've already given me a 2 nothing lead. I'm just going to be able to hit the strike zone. There we go. Her baseman makes a great play. Throws a little high, but okay, we got him out. Max Moroff hitting 268. What do you do? You play within yourself. We get a leadoff guy on. The next man Have a look at the fastball. Then our middle guys, maybe we hit a big bop to get in it. You don't have to go get two runs this inning. Just get one. Keep and he's going to hit a fly ball. Left fielder is going to track that one down. After it, he hauls it in without any trouble. And there are two away. So two quick outs here. Digging in the switch hitter, Josh Bell. First cut but our, uh, with the bases open. And kind of got lucky. Our control and hasn't been there. The dirt that's taken for a ball. These aren't going where I'd like them to. There's six pitches, three outs. Not bad. Nice quick inning. Maybe the offense can get me some more runs here on the board. Or we're going to go ahead and hit, so this should be interesting. Guy on second, two outs, so we got to swing away. Delivery to him on the way. That fastball is low. Um, he should give us something to hit. And that change up makes him jump, a swing and a miss. He jumped like low, but. That fastball inside right there. Early swing, got out in front of that off speed pitch. 
clearly looking for a fastball. Wow, look at that speed going down the line. That was slow. All right, so we're going to face here uh, Adam Frazier at 249 on the air. Adam Frazier, he'll get us going here in the bottom half of the second. See if we can have another nice quick inning. He's going to try to bunt. The change up outside. Yes. This is wide. One ball and one strike. Ready to deal. Here's the one one. Looks like he's no. Oh. Here we go. Three pitches. One out. Right to the left fielder there. Thought maybe that was gonna fall in, but hung up enough. Brought to you by Majestic. And these guys committed two errors last game, and it cost them. Oftentimes you'll see an error committed. Oh, I didn't see what Fisher's stats were. Either way, he's going to hit to the shortstop on the first pitch. So, but that's going to continue our average of two pitches and out. Into the box now, Chris Horn hitting just a bit over the Mendoza line on the year. He'll start him with a fastball down oh. and in for a I mean, if I can get out of this inning around 15 pitches, I'd be pretty happy. Now that's a good change up right there. You know the guy's sitting fastball. You get him out. Take a look at that cover. Seems like everything is coming up right now. That one was just outside. Let's bring the fastball up in the zone here. Pretty standard curve in the dirt, looking for a strike out there, but okay. it was a good job of recognizing it and holding Pass back. ball on the outside corner, maybe. Into the wind up. Not him looking. So that's our first strikeout. Strike three, and the side is retired. So they go that's something we haven't really been doing a lot of since we've come up to triple A. Louisville's out in front here. Getting those strikeouts. Coming to the plate now. Oh. Still two to nothing, bottom third. In there at the knees as he offers a strike to the leadoff man, nothing in one. Into the one. Counts looking pretty good. Hit well down the left field line, but back into the crowd. Two no two. See if we can get, get him to chase a curveball here. Or I'm just gonna. I don't know if I hung that one or not. We'll have to look here. Stay in there or what? That ball looked like it started behind him and came back over the plate, and he was able to get a base hit. All right, kind of looks like it was on the corner. Show track say. Yeah. It was higher than I wanted it, but. Elias Diaz, the next to hit. But he'll go after the first pitch and bounce it into foul territory. We can't get the double play before the pitcher comes up. On the ground, up the middle. There we go. We'll just go ahead and tidy that up a little bit. Boy, that's about as easy as it comes. A chopper, two-hopper, turns into a tailor-made 4-6-3 double play. Well, now we got the pitcher up. Stepping in now, Chad Cool. He's going to line out to the second baseman. So, give up the one hit, but we got the double play. Get out of it pretty easily. See if the, uh, the bats can get the bats going. For the Indians are back at the top of the their lineup. Go to nothing. We come out. We got out to that lead real fast, and that's been it. Okay. This fastball up. Maybe strike this guy out. And he goes up the ladder on him, but he lays off one and two. Curveball out here. Yeah. All right. If we can't get this double play ball. Here's Max Moroff standing in. He's Clean this up a little bit. And this pitch is taken on the inner half for strike one. Now the 0-1. And that one stayed too low. Why not let this inning get a little out of hand since the leadoff guy's on? And he takes it 
takes ball two, and it's two and one. Well, he clearly read the scouting report. This guy's been sizzling hot, and look at how Come on. he's pitching here. Ball three. This is one of those rare hitters counts we've seen in this game. They're just having a difficult time getting There we go. Takes a look at one catching the outside corner. With this change up out here. Got him swinging. Let's sit down. Josh Bell now. On hit that double play ball. That's a good fastball down the zone. Now some hitters are good low ball hitters, but that's exactly where you want to be. Ooh. And he lays off for ball one. Not having any luck with those out with, with those pitches out there. Squared that one up. Wouldn't say outside, but sometimes they're inside. This curved ball again. That one's gonna bounce away. So there goes the double play chance. And forget about the double play now as he'll move up to second here on the wild pitch. That was definitely a two strike curve. All right. The catcher turns his glove over and tries to this fastball up here. To block it, but with no luck. The ball skips away and it scored a wild pitch. Runner at second here. That might have to stay away from that curveball. Now a swing and a chopper foul right at home plate. This cutter inside. Got him. Like he Go sit down. There and he got him to swing through it for the second out. That was a good job there of using the batter's aggressiveness against him. He was putting up a good fight and fouling a lot of balls off. So as a pitcher, okay. it's a great idea to expand the zone even more. Nope, just need one more out to get out of this inning. After something that's even hard to foul off. And that'll bring in Adam Frazier. As he will take strike one on the fastball here, no balls. And jump out here. Hard, but lined out in his first step. He wouldn't chase. And this misses the outside corner, so it's knotted up at one and one. There is a base open here, so the option to work around him is there. Hey, cutter hits the inside corner there. Good riding action to that thing, and it's ball and two. Fastball up. Here's the one and two. Got him. Got him looking. And strike three called as he says, "You got to be kidding me with the side retired." So no runs on a hit. Okay, so here. we're no gonna, one gonna be left on. up we third. We're due up we're third. In front here. Two we're in the top of the fifth. Maybe we can just sacrifice bunt and get it over with. Nope. Two so outs. Nobody on. Shot. So we gotta swing Oliver away again. Oh for one for him here in this one. That and fastball tie. That ball's in the zone. Down at the knees for a strike. They're already into their bullpen. A swing and a miss on a ball that jammed him. I'll tell you, if I'm pitching right now, I'm not throwing anything near the strike zone until these guys prove they can lay off it. They're hey, two two count. Too aggressive. Now a fastball taken outside here as it moves it to two and two now. And, and now we're gonna fly out, left. pop out, fly out, I guess. And he'll get there in plenty of time to put this one away, and that ends the inning. So hey. we go down without a whimper. Here's the inning that we need to get through. The inning we've been having problems with, the fifth inning. He's over one thus far. Hitch count looks great. Into the wind up and the pitch. Lost it in the air out And right fielder's gonna get there. One pitch, one out. This horn digging in to try it him out with the change up out here. Comes into this at bat 0 for 1 in the ball game. And that's in there for strike one. His pitch count is in a really good place. Hey, this point a fastball here. He's pounding the zone and getting first pitch just out with it. Just like he did on the last guy. We might see him work deep into this game. Cutter in here. This up. There we go. Called strike two on the cutter. And he's you know what? Let's give this curveball a chance. There's nobody on. It's a one two count. Okay, a little, little bouncer out to the shortstop. Confidence up in that pitch a little bit. JB now. Oh, he's hitting 364 on the year. Fastball was higher than I wanted it to be, but. 
here we are in the middle innings, Matt, and he's over 80% first pitch strike. Yeah, there we go. You wonder why he's dominating right now. That's a great ratio. Getting ahead and getting up two outs outside here. And we're in the fifth inning, and he's got one. Got him. I think away from getting through five shutout innings. And there we go. We got through five. The inning is over. Nothing doing First time in the last three we're starts. Five here at the ballpark. The bats lead it two to nothing. See if they're going to let me continue. Yep, here we go, the bomb in the sixth. Still, uh, still 2 nothing. Really hasn't found its groove in this one. Yeah, only two hits so far, Matt. Don't know how much of a leash they're going to give me. We'll see if they can start Energy is about halfway. The wind up and the 0-1. And this one's tapped foul at home plate. Okay, so we got a nice 0-2 count. We can throw the curveball here. The wind up and the 0-2 pitch. And he'll try and tempt him with one in the dirt, but he'll hold back, back with the here. fastball up in the zone. Try to get him to chase that O2 curveball there, but he wasn't. Uh, of course he didn't go. Could see it again here though. Tried to hold up there, appeal down to first. Try the curveball again. No Just trying to get the confidence up in this. We might need it here. Chop foul over towards the coaching box. One thing you try to do as a hitter is figure out okay, what bring this cutter in. Pitching. I can't cover the whole plate. Got him. He's go sit really down. Job of pound him on the outside half for strikes, and they haven't figured it out yet. So he got him swinging. Elias Diaz becomes the might, uh, the might go ahead and get a quality start here. Smith will grab a bat and hit for the pitcher here. Something we've yet to do here in the Triple A. Takes this the other way to right. Maybe not, because, I mean, like I said, I'm not sure what my uh, my leash looks like. He comes on, first pitch, he gets a base hit. We'll see, are they going to be aggressive or continue to be passive? Standing in now, Mark Squire. We can get Mark to hit into a double play here. They're both pretty speedy guys, so. Got him there, we're not going to get, no, we didn't get him that second. Go throw got pulled off get him anyway, but a fine effort nonetheless well that's one of those unusual plays right there great hustle by the runner going to second base you just picked up your teammate a base hit they couldn't get the throw to second base in time so oh. before he gets a hit kind of a kind of a little disastrous moment here now as he takes a called strike it's 0 and 1 he's been getting ahead in the count all game long i think the key has been working off his fastball 1 and 1, and one. A little, a little disappointed that we don't have two outs here. Come on. There we go. That's probably going to score the rudder. So that air is going to come back to haunt us. That's going to be it. Well, at least we got through five. I'm happy about that. That's progress. Have a question is, are we going to be able to get the W? He could stand to win it. He could get a no decision. He could even be on the hook for the loss if both runners are I'm just, I'm hoping that we don't get, get stuck with the loss here. There are two on with only one away. Maybe we got the win. Common in baseball now these days to use a ton of pitchers to get through a game. And it took six here to get the job done. But, hey, they'll do whatever they can to get a W. What do we, what do we got here? Do we get the W? Come on. Looks like we did. We're in the middle of the, the pack there. Three to two, the finish in tonight's game. Oliver. Yep, Martin we got the W. Win on the mound, his second of the year. We go to Chad two and two. Was only able to work four innings. We'll bring you back. The loss. Oscar Sanchez hammers down the save. His twenty. With the postseason. Fourth approach, time this episode. The hitters challenged to step coach is uh, bringing us in. The hitting coach. This is the time in a season where a hitter, where a hitter needs to really bring it, Oliver. No, you have it in you. We've seen it. We're a pitcher, man. 
Um, I understand. His coach offers some tips, hoping the player can find a way to flip the switch down the stretch when his contribution is most needed. Hey, try to work the count a little up there. Be patient. Quality at bats one at a time. We're getting, we are not a good hitter. What is this guy even talking about? Yeah, all right. All right, here we go. 449 points. Grabbed uh, the win. Went five and a third. Didn't walk anybody. Got six strikeouts. Pretty good day. So, I think we are going to not have... Apparently, I never put that on. All right, so I think we're going to go pitching. Yeah, what's the stamina look like? Need to really start bolstering that up. Go stamina, some pitching clutch, and uh, not sure what else. Cut on the cutter. Get more speed on the curveball, maybe? I don't know. We'll go ahead and do that. But we got three points left to ride. Uh, thanks for coming hanging out. Don't forget to hit that like button. Subscribe for a star today. And uh, see if we get into the postseason. Catch you tomorrow. Doodles.